Konnichiwa, welcome or welcome back to my channel, my name is Grip. So for today's video, I am reacting to NCT Dream comeback music video. And this is, I think, is the first time I'm actually experiencing their comeback as an active fan. Those of you who doesn't know me and haven't watched my reaction journey to NCT, uh, which I did at the end of last year, I did react to NCT 127, NCT Dream, NCT U, and Wavy. And I do call myself anti NCT, but I was not very much keen on discovering NCT because I thought it was going to be very overwhelming. There's gonna be so many boys that I wouldn't be able to remember, which I did very quickly. I don't know, like that was the one of the best things that happened in my life. I'm enjoying NCT so much. I even went to NCT 127 Cafe at the beginning of March, which I talked about in my live stream last week. So if you haven't watched that live stream, maybe you can go watch the archive. I was talking about what I did there, what I ate, what kind of things I got there so you can also watch that video to find more about that. Also the exciting news is that I entered for NCT 127 tour in Japan which is happening in Tokyo in wait when is it? I think it's at the end of May. It's not been announced yet if I've got the tickets or not so I don't know if I'm going there yet but while I was putting an entry I actually officially became a uh, Sisney so you can officially call me Sisney now which is crazy because I've never called myself as specific fandom I mean I still love all the groups but I don't know it just felt right when I was actually buying the tickets for them so fingers crossed I will let you guys know if I've got the tickets or not on other social platforms so if you haven't followed me on Twitter or on Instagram uh, please go do so it's also under the same name uh, Grape in Tokyo so please go follow me and maybe say hi anyway so let's get into NCT Dream new music video have you guys been following all the teasers I'm sure you have if you don't know I am a huge Geno stan but with this visual game Nana I think he's Visual game is just a top notch in the game, like that mullet hair and how he like stares into the camera. I know he's a bit uh, cray cray, nuts, in the best way possible. It's a compliment. I love his personality because he's like so random. But when he's doing the photo shoot and in the music video and in every single killing part, he's like naming it. He is such a bias wrecker in this comeback teasing. So let's see what's gonna happen in the music video. I'm just letting you guys know that I will be doing an album reaction as well uh, which is going to be followed in next couple of days because I feel I think this is a second full album right so there's gonna be a lot of songs so I don't know how many videos I'm gonna break them down into but I will be posting my pure reaction to each song of the album. So yeah, please make sure to subscribe and check those videos in the future as well. All right, Glitch Mode by NCT Dream. Play. Wait, 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 let me quickly go back to that intro. I'm so sorry for doing this, but that was Hello Future, right? Yeah, it's Hello Future, okay. So are we in the future now? Dream Lab. Dream Lab? Are they actually moving like that or it's actually a choreo? But shut up! <laughs> I love, I love Hechan's voice. Hello! Hey! <laughs> Look at him! Is visual. Okay. Ah, oh, so dreamy. Ah. 
Come on and break spine. Oh my god, everyone's gonna be saying Oh, I just can't deal with that pink hair on Jenna. Guys. I love this uh, whole production. I love this part. Ooh, the icy styling. Was not expecting this what? Oh my god, that visual of Chiffin? I'm so happy it's ending with Jenna. That emoji floating around, so cute! Guys, I need to go listen to this on my headphones. I'll see you in a minute. <sighs> Guys, I have so many parts that I love in this music video and also the song. I don't know where to start. There are two parts I get so much goosebumps. First one is where the Ronjun, Ronjun, Longjun, I'm so sorry if I'm mispronouncing his name, where he sings the pre chorus and yellow flower. I don't even know where it is, but it's just like so. He's, ah, oh, I don't know how to explain it. I don't know if it's the melody or tone of his voice, but it just gives me the whole experience. I really, really love that part. Like when like silver hair Chisen and pink hair Jenno comes into the center and start giving the dance break but Mark with a vivid beanie comes into the center and gives us the whole dance career and break it's just goosebumps and when the ice how do you how do you call that like tiny little ice thing that hits Jenno's face Like it's it's too good. I want to punch my laptop. I mean, like I don't even have to tell you guys how much I love the color scheme and also the concept. The whole thing has this Y2K game arcade and also the kind of like a blockbuster. I don't know if the blockbuster is the worldwide thing. I'm pretty sure it is. You know, the places you go to rent out DVD. I mean, obviously the stage setting was inspired by that, but also it's got outer space station vibes. It's just like everything is so well put together, I think. And when they did this glitched choreo, I don't know if they're gonna do that glitch move in the actual dance performance, but I just really can't can't wait to go find that out. Now I think in terms of the music, I've already listened to this like three times with my headphone on. Like I said, I am in love with Longjun's part and as well as Hechan and Cholmo when they are singing slower parts. Like I love, if you know me, I really really love songs with the hint of melancholic touch and it has the perfect touch to that. But you know, when they go into the dance break, it's got that guitar, bass, I don't even know what the instrument is called, uh, rock band vibe, which honestly, have they done anything like this in the previous discography? It, I mean, it's S7, so I'm pretty sure they haven't done anything like that. But that twist was very interesting. And I've said in my previous reaction video that I'm not a huge fan of rock sound or rock music just in general, but this twist was very intriguing. Like. Now I was listening to it and I actually couldn't wait for that part. So I think I'm really enjoying this song. <laughs> I know I'm a bit like all over the place, but 
You guys get the idea, I am in love with this song. And I cannot wait to receive my albums that I purchased. I will actually do an unboxing of the entire album, so I will upload that video onto my channel. So if you like this video, and also if you want to see me unboxing NCT Dream Glitch Mode album, please make sure to subscribe and hit the bell button so you wouldn't miss any contents from me in the future. And like I said, if you haven't followed me on my Insta and Twitter, please make sure to do it. Uh, it's under Grape in Tokyo. So yeah. All right. I think that's it for this reaction video. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. And I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.